He's kind of falling over his lead foot because he's not able to move it as quickly as he could. Oh, oh big left hook landed for Clay Collard and the right hand oh. behind it. Oh, he's, got, he's, got, he's got Hurricane Shane Hurts on the retreat. Collard backing him up. This fight is becoming what we expected. Sean, going back to your point about the stance, I don't think Clay Collard's rear leg is doing very well. I think, oh, down with the calf kick. The front leg goes out from under him, but Clay Collard for the second time in this fight rolls through it and is back on his feet, not allowing Hurricane Shane to get on top of him. Oh, oh boy. the left oh. hook. Big left hook. Big left hook. I have this two rounds to none for Clay Collard at this point. Burgos is going to have to do something very, very special in this third round. He's thrown 416 strikes in this fight, Randy. Wow. As he goes back to work on the body. Lands another left hook. Oh, and there's a nasty inside leg kick again from Shane Burgos, who now beckons Collard on for the final 30. For your winner by unanimous decision and clinching their place in the million dollar PFL World Championship. Clay Collard! We've seen OAM ramping up the power on his strikes. He tries the traveling knee, eats a hook for his efforts. Now they're turning it up a little bit. So an interesting round one, Dan Hardy, who do you think won it? You know, I think OAM won the first round. I think he landed cleaner shots, but there was certainly some good work done by Miranda. But the big key for me was OAM showing him the takedown attempt in the... Oh! Nice left hand from OAM! He dropped Bruno Miranda, landed a nice right hand from the top position, too. It's almost fined in like he suck. Khabib Nurmagomedov stepped over the legs and traps him. Now in a high mount, bringing down the shots. OAM Mercier pounding away at Bruno Miranda, pulling away at this fight. Dan Murdoch taking it close. Look. Look. This That's is going to be it. And he waves it off. Wow. OAM to the championship with the ground and pound. Declaring your winner via TKO and clinching their place in the million dollar championship, Olivier Aubin Mercier. Right hand. Oh, oh, Walsh goes oh up big head kick. kick. And here's He's the in trouble. He's in trouble. Riyashi Ali Walsh jumped down onto Ed Davis, who stands right back up after the knockdown. Oh. Round two ahead. Good work there Hands from Ed. High. Hands high, there's that split cross Hands again. High. Trading jab for right hand. Now Ed Davis building some power. Oh, that hurt him. The right hand left. Oh, yeah. There he goes. Biagio hey, Ali hey, Walsh hey, the stoppage stop. in round two. Declaring your winner via TKO. Biagio Ali Walsh. A couple of times now I've seen Renfro. He's doing it again, shaking his arms and shoulders out. I wonder if he's feeling tension in his frame. Solomon Renfro speaking to Magomed Karimov, who slaps with a high kick. If Renfro's gonna go, it's got to be now, and he shoots it for a takedown! Big slam! There's 40 seconds on top, enough for Solomon Renfro. For your winner, by unanimous decision, and clinching their spot in the Million Dollar Championship, Megumin! Megumin! Kenema! Causing all kinds of problems for There's Leal. There's that knee. Another wow. one from Sadabu. Those are right up in the gut. Go to your butt. Bring your foot. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nice job, I saw him see. Get up, Paulus. Three minutes will decide if there's Someone oh. feeling a grave injustice. That was the knee we were told to watch for. Sadabu with a vicious knee right in the middle. And again, and then nice the jab. jab. For your winner, via split decision, 
and advancing to the 2023 PFL World Championship. Sanabu C! Sanabu C is headed to Washington, D.C. for a Black Friday showdown with Magomed Magomed Karamov.